Holy crap. Is this even real? Yo, what's up guys? Kelvin here and today we're gonna be looking at weird Japanese inventions you won't believe actually exist. So yeah, before I start the video, I just wanna tell you guys that I'm getting my braces off in two weeks. So mm, I've been wearing them for like two years and yeah, I'm pretty excited to get my braces off and I might sound very very different when I get my braces off or I might sound the same, I don't know but yeah, get ready to have some clean teeth instead of these braces Okay, so yeah, let's get started with the song Holy crap! Japanese people actually invented their air conditioned pits This one is definitely for the summer <laughs> Look at these fins, they look so weird I mean, if it get too hot, you can just wear shorts. There's no need for like air conditioning. Oh wait, maybe this is for winter time. You see how he is wearing long sleeve and long pants. Maybe it's heating system for pants. But yeah, it still kind of look weird though. Will you guys wear these pants to the public? Not really sir. The first Japanese inventor we have is a hand chopper to prevent you from cutting your own hand. Whoa, <laughs> I don't know about this one though, but I think it's pretty useful because when you cut stuff, you don't want to chop your own finger off. Yeah, you gotta use a fake hand when you cut it, you'll cut the fake hand. But the thing is, I don't know how to cook. All I know is ramen noodles and then some rice. I know how to cook rice, that's good because all the Asians eat rice every day. Next up, we have a vending machine that sells cars you can buy cars like you can buy dr peppers and coke bottles i mean yeah that's pretty amazing i've never seen these in america it's invented by japanese people that's right it's only in japan i think but yeah how will you order it like when you order it does it does the car inside just come out of the vending machine i'm not really sure how does it work but all i know is pretty cool I would love to experience it. How much do you think this little tiny car costs? Maybe 10,000 or 20,000? It's a little tiny car, maybe like 8,000. I'm, I'm not really sure, but yeah. Let's move on with the next one. Next up, we have helmet hair massage. Uh, I don't know about it. Is the shape look pretty weird, but I wonder how it feels when you put the machine in your head and it will massage it for you like this. I mean, if you want to massage your hair, you just gonna you see your own hair is easier you know why would he buy like this in the sink and you put it in your head it look kind of weird on your head i guess this thing is for lazy people only that is too lazy to massage their own hair clearly as you can see in the picture the guy is enjoying it so much he's giving it a thumbs up okay next up we have a cushion you can rest or lean on while you are laying on the floor doing work i definitely need one of these because I would love to lay on my bed like this, you know, and then just do some work, like type on the computer or play my iPod. Yeah, but this is very useful. This is probably my favorite Japanese invention. I wonder how comfortable it is. I mean, will the chest start hurting if it's laid down way too long? I'm not really sure. I have to test out the product. If it's really comfortable, then this will be my favorite product. Next invention is really really weird it's called a device that can actually see what's inside of your ear whoa this sounds very creepy who would want to see what's inside of your ear it's just nasty stuff i bet someone also invented a device that can also see what's inside of your nose oh yeah so yeah let's move on so next up we have napkin pits so basically, the pants have napkins inside of them. These, I guess people are way too lazy to grab a tissue and then dry your own hand. I mean, it's pretty convenient though. When you watch, finish washing your hand, you just walk out, put your hand in the back and you just dry your hand with your pants. It will look kind of weird though. Like, who will wear these pants with napkins in it? This is called a pillow hat. So when you wear a hat, you will have a pillow at all times. You know what's useful? This will be super useful if you're going to travel to another country in the airports. It's very hard to sleep and it's very hard to find a bed and a pillow. But if you have this hat pillow, you'll be so useful. You can just lay down in the chair and you have pillow automatically on your head 
and then when you wake up, you probably forgot about the pillow, so you walk around the whole airport with your pillow on your head. It might look weird, but it's very, very convenient, and your hair is very, very comfortable. <laughs> Next up, we have umbrellas that allow you to see what's in your pack. This is like a genius invention right there. This is not weird at all. I would definitely buy this umbrella. If you are from Japan and you saw this umbrella, you can just send it to me. That would be great. I'd probably give it like a shout out on Instagram or something. So yeah. Next up, we have a Goldfish Aquarium phone booth. You heard it right. It's a phone booth with goldfish inside of it. Who will feed them? Like, is it just for public to see? And then, do they, do they pay like a fee to just watch the fish? Or what? Because someone has to feed the goldfish. I mean, they don't just eat each other and grow, right? Someone has to feed them. Oh wait, if you look at it closely, the phone is inside the thing. So you, you can't just make a phone call using this phone booth. I thought you can make a phone call, but you can't. Next up, we have a solar power cigarette lighter. So if you uh, smoke cigarette and you don't have a lighter, you can use the natural the mother nature to light your cigarette for you for free but guys don't you don't need to smoke or anything it does not look cool and it's very very bad for your health so don't smoke yeah but yeah let's move on to the next one next one we have a tie that can protect you from the rain so basically you are wearing a tie and the next thing you know you have an umbrella when you open it how cool is that what the heck we got umbrellas that can protect the hills. That does not make sense. I mean, all you need is a really giant umbrella and you will cover all your clothes and your shoes. I don't think it's necessary to have umbrellas on your heels. This is <laughs> so weird. This is like the most bizarre invention ever. Yeah. Next up, we have Noiseness Mute Karaoke Microphone. So if you're a bad singer and you love to sing, you should get one of this because when you sing, let me sing a song. <laughs> Nobody will hear it. You'll be like, let me love you. See, I'm a bad singer and I should definitely get this because I sing a lot. I thought I'm a good singer. When I sing, when I hear myself sing, it sounds so perfect. And then when my brother hear my singing, he said that I sound like a dying duck. Yeah, that hurt my feeling a lot. I don't know why I can get this, but I definitely want one of these so I can sing all the time on top of my lung and nobody will bother me again. Next up, we have Ear Enhancer. What the heck? This is an Ear Enhancer. Basically, if you can't hear really good, you can use this and you'll hear really, really good. Like when someone's whispering, you can, you can hear it loud and clear. The only downside is you look like a what do you look like? A Mickey Mouse? Mickey Mouse have ears that look, that is very huge too. I don't know what you look like. You look like an alien that is from another planet with giant ears. Yeah, let's move on. If you guys ever think of having a baby, you should definitely get this baby clothes. <laughs> the baby will clean your floor for you. How cool is that? This one is very very good idea. I mean baby just crawl around and that baby don't even realize that he or she is cleaning the whole house for me. I mean I don't I will never have to uh, mop or swipe my floor again because my baby will <laughs> just climb around the floor all the time and yeah it's a win-win for me. Next time we have expensive square watermelon. These watermelons are actually invented by Japanese people. You know how the watermelons are always round, but these are square. They uh, they are grown inside like a, a square box when they are little, and then when the watermelons start growing, it will take the shape of the box. And it is very very hard to grow because sometimes the watermelon will explode. So that's why it's very expensive. And I think it'll taste the same. I don't know. It'll taste sweet or not sweet but the shape is very very interesting and these watermelons are usually bought as a gift to a family member holy crap is this even real next up we have the cheating shirt 
So this shirt, if you look at it closely, you have a little tiny pocket in it, and you just put your notes inside it, and then when you take a test, you just open the note like this, and then you can tea on it. I don't know if it's a good idea or not. So Japanese people invented this. They should invent one for the boys, you know? It's very useful, you can just... I don't know if this cheating method is effective or not. I mean, you, you, when you take a test, you'll look like this. People will think that you're looking at your own nipples. So I don't know if this is a good idea or not. So yeah, this is about the end of the video. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up right now. And make sure to subscribe to this channel for more updates. This is Calvin Lee, and I'll see you guys next video.